All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how to turn on a um, Gateway FX laptop um, that has a damage button key. Yes, I bought this off of Craigslist from a shady person who didn't tell me about this. Um, I didn't find out until I get home that there is a connector that is broken off from the motherboard. I'm not sure if it's one of those where you can uh, connect to uh, and solder it on. Uh, it looks like it could be because the one on the soundbar, the one on the soundbar is still uh, at, still attached, but you can see the tab um, is gone. Uh, but then uh, there's a little latch that hold, um, pins down the ribbon. That part is gone, but I saw on eBay there's a replacement for that, so um, I didn't feel like um, doing it because I think you may need to solder. Uh, let me see. You probably have to solder the pins on on the back, and I that's I'm not at that level. I can't solder something that small, so I decided to sell this on eBay. Yeah, actually I'm making this video for the buyer. Um, so they can test out this motherboard when they get it. Um, this motherboard is actually good besides the pins, uh, I mean the connectors. So here I go, uh, this is how you turn it on. You have a tool, you have a tool that looks like this. Just basically you just need to jump the two pins. And I think it's around here, but I think you just touch every single one. You can hear the lap, uh, the hard drive go on. Yeah, I think it just did. So I think it's somewhere around here. So now going back to here, you can see that it's turned on. And then also with this laptop is the, um, I think it's either the inverter or the or the um, bulb is out. I hope it's inverter because I changed the bulb once and it was a pain in the neck. Uh, inverter is a lot easier to do. Okay, now you can see lightly that uh, there's something in the screen. So the screen is good. It's either the inverter or the bulb. And then, so now I have it connected to the external monitor. And there it goes. Exact same image.